Based in Hunt Valley, Maryland, EA is a global engineering and technology firm that already has a presence here on Guam. Guam office manager Bob Schombach declined comment today because they have yet to receive official notification of the award. Port General Manager Monty Mesa, too, said that the port is still awaiting the official confirmation, but he said the selection of a manager to oversee the modernization effort is critical to the port's future. Well, this is a great indication that uh, once we get this thing done, it, it'll uh, ensure that uh, additional funding in the future allocation uh, from uh, Congress uh, that will uh, continue, hopefully, that uh, we get the funding needed for the second phase of the modernization of the port. The Maritime administration will directly oversee EA's execution of the contract, which calls for an electronic container tracking system and enlarging the container storage yard at the port. That would be uh, looking at expanding the container yard space, uh, looking at uh, our uh, IT system to, to have the, um, the technology, you know, uh, electronic technology uh, put in place to, uh, again, track all the cargo that's coming in and out of the port, uh, as well as uh, complete uh, some of the building demolition to add uh, uh, container yard space, but and, and also uh, constructing additional office space at the main uh, administration building. EA's management contract is a cost reimbursement contract worth an initial $2.9 million, but it could go higher once the $159 million in USDA loans and DOD transfer funds comes through, if it comes through. And Mesa says it has to come through because the buildup can't happen without those funds. It has to be uh, uh, executed, otherwise we will become a choke point if the construction is not completed. Now, do we know where this $159 million is coming from now? Well, uh, the next $100 uh, million would, would be funding allocated in 2012 and 2013, and that's why it's very important that, that we continue to work with uh, the congressman's office and uh, the administration, uh, as well as Department of Defense, to make sure that we get uh, either through their funding in the 2012 or 2013 or uh, direct appropriations for the Port Improvement Plan, uh, Program. Kevin Kerrigan, PNC News.